my loves and welcome back to the channel y'all so i hope you guys are all doing good today so guys in today's video it's a little different today um i am actually on my way to go look at a property um it is like a townhouse slash like condo i'm assuming um and basically i'm thinking about investing into it but um of course obviously i gotta see it first etc but i am about to go um look at that i think the viewing um is at five o'clock i'm pretty sure it's at five the time right now is 4:41. it's only a few minutes from my home so i do want to go um see that and i actually want to bring you guys with me of course so this is actually my first time actually um looking at a townhome so i'm kind of excited because I'm just curious, like, the type of vibes that they actually got. So, I want you guys to comment let me know. Uh, do you guys live in a townhome? And if you do, how many bedrooms do you have? And would you guys recommend um, somebody to uh, purchase a townhome, um, etc. So, yeah. Um, I did make my coffee today. I just actually just made it, really. So, I got my coffee right here. And um, we are set to go. So, like I said, hope you guys are doing well today. And I'm not sure what I'll do after this. Let's go ahead and head out. Okay, so it's, it's down here somewhere. Look, okay. So okay, guys, so this is how the outside looks. Right here. It looks pretty nice. Let's walk up here. Okay, so this is like um, the little walkway going down. Super cute. It has like a little fenced in like little patio. That's cute. So you walk down here. And then it has a light right there. That's really cute. Then it has like a little garden. Okay. This is the garage right here, guys. Yeah. It looks really nice. Opener. No, this actually looks kind of brand new. This looks really nice. Yeah, this is coming from the garage. Nice. Okay. And this is like a little, the little living room part right here. Okay. Yeah. So this is like this a little living room part. Right? Okay. Really nice. So um, like, um, right now my living room is pretty big. Um, but um i'm pretty sure yeah this anything that you see stays okay so okay that okay if you want an entertainment center that's okay so this is like the living room right here walkway this is how it looks right here i love the walkway coming in and then if you turn around right here this is the living room okay so washing and dryer oh nice Works fine everything in here works great oh wow do this washing and dryer stay Everything, oh, wow. everything stays that you see. Oh, wow. I spent months getting it out of That's here. That's really generous of you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, this is a nice little laundry room right here. A little laundry room. And it's actually inside of a bathroom, too, as well. Which is different. Okay. So, this is how it looks with the laundry room right there. Okay. And so, this is like a little dining room area part, right? Yeah. Which I thought was really cute. Okay. And then, let's see. So just like the little dining room part oh, right here. Oh, that's been redone back in there, that stone. Okay, just like a little kitchen area. Okay, I like the floors. Look kind of updated. That's nice. Oh, stove is looking nice. Yeah. Stove is it's nice. It's nice. I mean, it's it's very livable place. I agree. And I was very cozy as well. Nice stove. And I actually like that the kitchen is like kind of like cornered like this. Yeah. It gives it like a really cozy vibe. Like, you know, like maybe have like a cute, it's, it's really cute. I like it. And I actually love the island too as well, which is really nice. I see like some little chairs over here. Stuff like that. I actually just love the view from right here. Really nice. It's got a garbage disposer. It works fine. Okay. Nice. I love the cabinets as well, which can always be either painted or replaced. Then it also has a little counter space for right here and then a dishwasher. Then it has like a little refrigerator. All right. Look and, at the uh, chandelier. There's like the little hallway right here. Also has a closet. A nice little deep closet right here. Okay, guys, so this is the little patio part I was saying. It's so cute. You know, I love the fact that the patio is private. Like, that is really nice. And the doors are gorgeous. I love it. The area seems pretty safe. Okay, and it has a screen. Okay, nice. Excuse all the leaves. Oh, no, you're fine. My sister's been coming over okay. and showing it to some people. Uh, when the real estate agent can't come. Okay, nice. Has a nice little it saves me storage. Okay, say storage. Really nice. Absolutely. Yeah, this is yeah, this is a nice little size patio. Okay. And this is the view going back in. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. And I've got a double shot at six. Okay. We're here. Yeah. Nice. 
So all of a sudden. Yeah, because I feel like all of the condos and townhomes that's on the market just don't have like the the interest that this, you know, that this has and stuff like that. So I, I mean, think the reason why people are wanting to look at it, they see where interest is gonna go up in the future. Yeah. The feds yeah. Keep pumping it up. I know it's crazy. And so they're wanting to do something if they're ever gonna do it. These are the stairs right here going upstairs, as you guys can see. Really cute. And then I love this window. And then look at the oh that is so cute. Y'all, we can customize this so well. Y'all know I ain't never had a chandelier like this, but look at that. That's a keeper. Okay. And the one downstairs in the dining room stays too. Nice. Okay. Here, I love how it got like a little walkway right here. <laughs> this is adorable. This is the master bedroom. Same thing there. Oh, this is the master. That is a sleeper sofa. This and is nice. It's in perfect shape. I pulled it out and looked at it. There's no stains. It's only been slept on about three or four times. You have some really vintage. <laughs> vintage. <laughs> Vin Look at this light. Oh, I love these little curtains right here. This little thing. desk right here. Nice. The curtains look really nice. So these are the curtains in the bedroom, guys. Oh, Carpet can always nice. be hard work, but this is like, and this is the master bedroom, right? It did. It's still a little bit light. You can see in these rooms because there's no lamps in there. Okay, yeah, of course. And this is the master, and this is like the little hallway right here where you come in. Really cute. Super cozy. So this is a second bedroom in here. Yeah, there's three bedrooms. Uh, okay. I always called that the den, that one you just came out of. Okay. This is a bedroom. This, this is a bedroom. Okay. In. Okay. All right. This is the bedroom right here, which can easily be an office. Inventory room. Got a little window. Okay, I love the little view. Has a little view there's, right oh, there. There's a pool up there. Oh, uh, yeah. Pool in the tennis courts. Yep, I meant to tell y'all they have a pool in a tennis and court. That's all okay, guys, so this is the bathroom. This is the bathroom upstairs. Mm -hmm. So, this is the mirror right here. Really nice. Nice little shower head. The wallpaper is kind of cute. Okay. Looks nice. It, you know, it's actually a really nice size bathroom, actually, really. Mm -hmm. It's really nice. Okay, it's the bathroom. Nice this little hall. This is the bedroom. Uh, this is the twin bed that I slept on. I'm just leaving it. I don't, you know. Okay. Okay. If you want it, here's All right. Case. Nice. This is another bedroom. Walk-in closets are nice. And this is so the third bedroom. So this is the little. I can see it now. Can y'all see like a little a, cute tree like in the I corner? Said, there's nothing that doesn't work. Okay. You know, uh, washer and dryer, the range, the refrigerator, the freezer, and the mm -hmm. and the garage works. Uh, mm -hmm. Everything works for sure. I love that it got a little laundry hook up inside the bathroom. Okay, guys. So a little bit about this condo. It is a three bedroom, two bath, twelve hundred and thirty square feet, and the HOA fees are two hundred and twenty seven dollars a month. It does have a swimming pool, a private patio, tennis court, sliding glass doors, and Carpet, so yeah.
hey guys welcome back to a brand new video guys so in today's video i wanted to introduce you guys to my new orve split duvet cover if you guys are not familiar with orve they are a company who sells split duvets and also natural cotton and organic bamboo sheets so guys this orve bamboo split cover has a magnetic seam so it can come apart when you and your partner are in the bed and you guys want to go to separate sides of the bed and it will come apart but basically i have two of the split duvets right here and you and your partner can have your individual duvets in the bed also it is temperature regulated so you guys can actually choose different temperatures for your body types at night we're going to go ahead and set up our orve split duvet i'm super excited because i've never had a split duvet cover that actually comes apart magnetically and you can switch your own temperatures like that is like a bomb also guys i will be saving you guys some money today so if you guys would like to purchase your first herve split duvet cover or sheet set i do have a coupon code below in the description box it is imani15 for 15 percent off of your first purchase i am super excited to set this up so without further ado let's go ahead and get started the array is the only split duvet bedding with magnetic inseams that allows you to sleep next to your partner but still you guys can have your own duvet cover and customize on both half with bedding and temperature as well. Say goodbye to waking up to cold and coverless nights. So you guys will not have to like have like a tug of war anymore. So it's just a better improved night deep sleep for you and your partner. So I am actually unboxing the split duvets right now. What I love about these, the first thing I noticed that they do have these little travel size laundry totes. So basically you can like travel with these and take them with you. Like that is literally genius. I love that. Also, it comes in a size king and queen. And also the material is the natural cotton or the organic bamboo. It comes in a sort of colors. Literally it comes in white, look like green, gray, blue, red, like a cream and like some different like patterns, really nice. And then also how it works is that you pick your comforter weight. So they have the lightweight, cool, and then they have the all seasons warm. So I end up picking the all seasons because I tend to get chilly, whether it is the fall time or the summertime. So you can definitely pick your temperatures and it definitely have the temperature labels on there as well, which I love. Like I said before, say goodbye to the tug of wars and being coverless because once you and your partner is in bed you guys can just cocoon by yourself if you choose to and like i said you can choose your temperature so if you sleep warm cool or someone in between it doesn't matter because the inserts let you decide what temperature you want to sleep in and also you can mix and match between lightweight and all seasons all seasons if you're a sleeper who is cold at night and doesn't have issues waking up hot and who likes the coziness of a fluffy blanket which is me, <laughs> with someone of a heavier weight, not quite a weighted blanket, but a slight heaviness. Then they recommend their heavy all seasons. This is a great option for cool climates if you live in an area with cold winters, which is definitely where I live. And then the lightweight, if you're a hot sleeper, constantly stripping off the covers and sweating in the night, then they recommend the lightweight. This is also a great option for hot climates or to swap into a peak summer months. So guys, as you see, we have one of the split duvets already put together and then I'm going to put the other one together and then I'll show you guys how it just magnets together. Very simple and easy. And it also has ties as well to go at the top and the bottom and the middle, which I love because other duvets don't do that. So they actually have a tie in the middle too as well, which is just really nice. Also, what I love is that the magnetics are actually hidden inside the duvet split covers. So they are just seamless and just work together very well. And as you guys see right here, I'm just giving you guys an example of if you and your partner was in the bed and you wanted to sleep over on the other side, you can easily just move over and just basically just have your own little space. Not to mention you'll have your own temperature as well. So if your partner is a hot sleeper, they can have their cool blanket. And if you're a cool sleeper, you can have your warm blanket. And it's also labeled at the bottom so you would never get confused. Also, when you actually put the covers back together, it is so easy. It just goes back together. Literally, you just throw it on there and you just go back together just like so perfectly easy so i love this y'all 
I'll have all the links in the description for you guys to shop if you guys would like to try your first split duvet out. I want to thank Herbe for sponsoring today's video. Now let's get into the rest of the video. and welcome to a brand new day guys so in today's video we are going to do a christmas decor haul i did grab some items when i ended up going to the stores yesterday so i got some stuff for the front porch so i'm super excited because y'all they had some cute stuff in the stores yesterday so my color scheme is going to be red so keep that in mind and also i want to show you guys some items that i end up getting from Ulta beauty as well like for as gift sets stuff that they have for skincare beauty and makeup and stuff like that so without further ado let's go ahead and get started okay, guys, so the first item i want to show you guys is this uh candle that i am getting from burlington it is a red poinsettia hand poured scented candle it is by the brand paper white candle right here it has like this little gold frosted flake super cute and it comes in this really nice round like red frosted little container really really cute this is how the top of it looks and then this is how the front of it looks super super cozy and it smells really good i've actually never had a candle that actually smells like this so this smells really good i like it a lot but i do want to put this on my dining table because i don't have any candles on my dining table and i actually don't have any red on my dining table so this would be a nice pop of red and then i also want to like maybe add some cherries on the plates to kind of bring that red to the table so super cute but yes this is the first thing that i got so the next thing i end up getting is a reef now i am going to do like a red color scheme but more like on like the glam side sort of um so i do have this really cute reef that i want to use so this is the reef right here it is a nice size reef this is actually how it looks super cute these are some details up close for you guys and i just think it is absolutely stunning this did come from burlington and this reef was actually i believe like 34.99 but isn't she stunning like so pretty and i just love how it has the cherries in there and then it has like the little red little um like floral like i said it is like a flocked little wreath super cute but i just thought this would go really pretty on my front porch i want you guys to comment let me know what you think about this i think it's really cute with that pop of red so yeah this was 34.99 from burlington so next i end up finding this really cute like joy sign and it actually goes with the reef too as well super cute and i got this from burlington as well and it was 8.99 this is actually what i'm going to use for my front porch like isn't it so cute guys like she is so adorable 
So this is what I'm going to use for my mat. And then I also got another sign that this do say joy. I wish it kind of said something else. But guys, I did not want to miss the opportunity to have this green little sign. Because I'm used to doing like the black and white. And I just felt like this green, white, and red was just so cute. And it just screams Christmas. And then I love how it got like the little bow up there that matches the reef in the rug. And it has cherries as well. So I was like, this is like perfect. So I really did not want to miss the opportunity to um, get this. But I thought this was super cute. This also came from Burlington. And this was actually $19.99. And it says joy to the world. So guys, that is all of the home decor that I end up getting from the stores. Now I want to show you guys what I end up getting from Alta. I did order some like Christmas skincare uh, gift sets for family members, etc. from Alta. So I want to show you guys um, what I have. And then also let you guys know what they are going to be having on sale for this Black Friday. So stay tuned. Right, we do have our Alta Beauty Box. I did go ahead and order some items offline. So... I did go ahead and get some items from the website and got it shipped to my house. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing that I have is the Ultimate Eye Line Up. It is the set that has the Clinique Take Off the Day Cleansing Balm. I did want to try this simply because of the cleansing balm that's in here because I want to use this to take off my makeup because I'm tired of using wipes. I feel like they dry my face and I'm just over it. And then it just comes with like a little gift set like how my other one was, which I got another one too for a gift for somebody. And it also has the um, Clinique All About the Eyes in here, a high impact eyeliner and a full size mascara. So this is how it looks. And this is just the one that has the little um, take off the day makeup cleansing balm and a little small little eye puffer for your eyes and big size of eyeliner and a mascara so this did retail from Alta Beauty for a gift set and this gift set was $25 and it is a value of $60 so again ladies if you guys are into like cleaning products or if you guys just want to get it for a gift or a loved one um you can go ahead and get this as a gift as you see it has like a little gift little um wrap on there it's super cute so this is the first thing that I got and like I said they do come in a set and then they actually give you like a little information right here and then also on the back this is how it looks and they just show you what all comes in your little gift set so the second thing that i end up getting is the clinique's mvps um little set it is um, actually a value of 52 dollars. you guys have seen this before in my videos um it is basically the moisture surge and all about the liquid facial soap with the small mascara and a eyeliner just not the liquid one and this is how this looks i end up getting this as a gift for someone and this is thirty dollars and it comes with all of these items in here as well like i said um they do have a sale pretty much on everything like this when it comes to clinique so yeah definitely take advantage and like i said black friday they'll have even more sales and deals. And then next, I wanted to try this Clinique Dramatically Different Moisturizing Lotion. Now, my grandmother did tell me about this, and she was telling me to try it out. So I did get the little three-step, um, little healthy-looking skin set for $18. This is actually how it looks. Okay, so it comes with a little lotion, and it's like a little cleanser, um, and then it has like the soap in there. Now, this did retail for $18, and it is a value of $24. It is like a three-step little process it is the Clinique skin school set and it basically shows you how it goes and it basically tells you how to use it too as well and that's how this look it's super cute packaging so I end up getting one of these simply because I wanted to try out the Clinique lotion if you guys do not know I am already using the MVP set with the cleansing soap and then also the moisture surge um, so I'm very excited to use the little um, bottle right here because I wanted to try the little um, yellow bottle. I want you guys to comment and let me know. Have you guys used the little small yellow bottles? This is how it looks. And do you guys use it for your skincare as well? But literally, y'all, this was the only reason why I had got it was because of that. So, <laughs> I know, right? Now, um, all of my purchases did come with a gift except for one. Because one, I had got a perfume. And I don't think that came with a gift. I'm going to show you guys the gifts that came with all my stuff. Now, like I said, everything pretty much came with a gift except for one thing. Now, the first gift is the Clarifying Lotion by Clinique. It came in like this little small bottle. So, I have this in one of my sets already. It just comes with a gift with one of them. So, I have this right here. And then another gift that I end up getting 
is some perfume this was actually like a mystery gift and it basically came with like a little bag of perfumes like this and basically it comes with perfume samples so we have the valentino perfume sample y'all all of them smell so really good but i'm gonna tell y'all which one is my favorite one and then we also have the prada perfume sample okay and then we have the jador perfume sample by dior and y'all the last one is literally hands down my fave and i'm thinking about purchasing it like oh my goodness it is the miss dior honey this miss dior y'all smells so good oh my god this smells so good y'all i'm really thinking about purchasing it now they do have like the small bottles for like 40 and then they have like the regular bottles for like 90 which i feel like it's kind of affordable compared to like a lot of other luxury perfumes that I have smelled or seen on the market. But yeah, this was like the little mystery little gift that actually came with one of my purchases, which was a free gift. And if you guys don't know, um, also right now has little gift sets and then also it has a plus free gift that comes with like most of their sets. So, so definitely take advantage because they will have that while supplies last. And then another free gift that I ended up getting was this really cute little Clinique bag. This is how it comes, but not only did I get a little bag, honey, we got some products in here. So in this little bag, they give you a Clinique little scrunchie. So this is how it looks. They give you like a little Clinique scrunchie. And then they give you some skincare products. Now the skincare products that you get is the Clinique All About Clean Rinse Off Foaming Cleanser. It is a Mousse Hydro Cleanser. This is how it looks, okay. And then it comes with the Clinique Moisture Surge 100 hour. So you also get this in there too as well. Like honey, these are the gifts. Like what? This was a whole gift with my purchase. This was a W. It's all type of gifts for the girls, okay? So the bag is super cute. It's how the bag look like a neon green in the um, inside. So cute. It's gonna be real cute for a girl. But yeah, and this was a free gift with my purchase. So like I said, ladies, take advantage take advantage and then last i just end up getting this ariana grande rim perfume this is a gift that i'm going to give somebody it's just like a little travel perfume and it came from Ulta beauty okay which this uh retail for i think 24 dollars and it's just a travel so girl <laughs> yeah <laughs> so yeah guys that's basically everything that i end up getting from Alta beauty in the stores for the decor for the front porch i'm very excited i'm trying to think if i want to actually do the front porch in the next video or go ahead and do the kitchen i want you guys to comment down below which one should i do first the porch or the kitchen but i feel like just because we did a living room already i feel like it just makes sense to go ahead and do the kitchen and just get it knocked out i kind of pre already did it but i was just really excited about the little cocoa bar because girl cocoa bar is really cute so i was excited about that but we do have to finish the rest of the kitchen and i'm not gonna lie i feel like i want to get um a few more items for the front porch too as well like i feel like i want to get like a little red and white mat to go up under this one um like a wide like longer one i think that'd be really cute um either all red or red and white but i want you guys to comment and let me know i want you guys to comment and let me know what do you guys think about the front porch decor are you guys shopping at also beauty for black friday or have you guys already got like some clinic products that has um, gift sets with little free gifts. And are you guys going to be purchasing some skincare and perfume from there too as well? So. Y'all, let me go ahead and touch on the townhome real quick. Now, as you guys seen in the beginning, I was looking at a townhome. Now the townhome is really, really cute. Um, but I feel like it's kind of small. Like even if I wanted to like live there in the future, I feel like it's kind of small and honestly I think that was more like a condo instead of a townhome because I feel like the rooms were extremely small and it was just certain things that made me feel like it's probably a condo versus a townhome but it's really really cute. As you guys see it has its own entrance to the front door which I love and then also like a little garden over to the side which is really cute. Um, also it'll be good for like a rental property and I love the fact that it had the attached garage and your own patio which is closed in and private. So like I said it does have its little perks I'm not gonna lie like it does have little stuff that I wouldn't mind having if I decided to downsize one day. Um, I like the kitchen a lot. I think that little uh, bar area can be like kind of knocked down and open, which will make it like a open concept kitchen with the kitchen and then also the dining table area. Really cute. Now the living room is a little small. It's definitely smaller than my living room. 
um but i feel like it's still doable and it's super super cozy now the master bedroom has a lot of potential okay a lot of potential in the master bedroom um the other two bedrooms are small so like if i had a kid in like one of the other bedrooms i feel like they would pretty much grow out of that because it's so small so i don't i don't know how i feel about that but other than that uh super cute um i thought it was unique that the um laundry room was inside the bathroom and i love the fact that it's actually two bathrooms instead of one and it does have some really nice storage so i want you guys to comment and let me know do you guys live in a condo and how do you guys think about the condo that i end up looking at okay can you guys see the potential and can you guys see the vision comment let me know about the overall vlog also let me know if you guys are going to purchase your first herve bedding set or your sheets or your split duvet for you and your partner and stuff like this so, so guys that is going to conclude today's video i love you guys i hope you guys have a happy thanksgiving okay and i will see you guys in my next one bye guys